I'm Yannick, this is Amazing Minds. Security's gone through an evolution of automation. Developers were faced and interfaced with the business, and the business said, well, I want to take product features to market faster. So as developers moved very quickly to develop all these features, they would huddle over these untested, unproven applications to operations, and operations would say, well, wait a minute, this application is not fit for purpose. And this is where DevOps came together. So developers working with operations to solve business outcomes but also moving at the speed that the business needs to take advantage of market opportunity. I think the adoption rate of cloud within Australia has been paramount. As an example, our business looks to Australia to understand what new demands the market is having. Australia has got an increased focus on adopting cloud uh, for their businesses to make them successful. Security and automation have evolved together, uh, and uh, the reason why DevSecOps has kind of really come to light is, is there are people now specializing in the domain. Uh, yes, it is a buzzword, uh, but certainly it is a focus now uh, in terms of automation for a lot of organizations. What DevSecOps really brings to the table is, over time, you can test for that assurance that that product, that technology that you release is ultimately secure. Rackspace's business is all about expertise and part of having the type of team that I have is it allows me to uh, pick skills that uh, cross-pollinate all domains and all capabilities that also includes security. There's a lot of demand around security engineers that understand both the security domain and automation. Thank you.